Hello. As requested, I'm going to do a collective soulmate reading. So if this reading responds with you, I'm just going to pick up some messages for you. Just let me know. Subscribe. Like the video. Collective soulmate reading. I'll pick right away from my Archangel Michael deck. Collective soulmate. Come through. Self respect. Self respect. Learn to love yourself. How about this? Learn to love the things about you that you don't think are lovable. Pay attention to your dreams. Hmm. Some of you say you don't remember your dreams. And then you might have a feeling of deja vu later on. See if you can uh, maybe keep a pencil and a paper and write down what you do remember from your dreams. Go forward fearlessly. Go forward fearlessly. Know that the universe is working in your best interest. And all things happen for a reason. Where am I drawn to next? Okay. Soulmate in separation. Soulmate in separation. Collective reading for soulmates. Soulmate in separation. Thank you. Soulmate in separation. Oh, one more. Soulmate in separation. Thank you. Ah, everyone together. I'm a better person because of you. You inspire me to heal and grow from my past experiences. There's a difference. Here, I'm put this right with self-respect. I'm a better person because of you. It's a recognition of, of soul evolution, of growth. And an acknowledgement that they have done this because of your great energy and unconditional love. Know your worth. That goes right with this. I didn't believe in myself or in you. I let my low self-worth ruin our love. I want us to heal together. That is right on time. Self-respect. Know your worth and realize that you're a person in, in the process of growing. Pay attention to your dreams. Let's see. I want to show you who I really am. I'm ready to bring down my walls and share my true feelings. That's a dream come true. Especially when someone doesn't feel lovable. What? I contradict. Oh, two came out. I contradict myself and give you mixed messages because I don't know what I want. I contradict myself and give you mixed, mixed messages because I don't know what I want. Or I'm afraid to say it or admit to myself. I don't deserve you. You're too good for me. I took you for granted and treated you badly. I'm sorry. Okay, this person is realizing some of the negative effects of having a low energy, or having fear control their destiny. Go forward fearlessly without allowing fear to dictate your life. I feel safe confiding in you, right? Go forward fearlessly. I feel safe confiding in you. I trust you completely. I can share all of my secrets with you. Okay, so now... New revelation. You're the love of my life. You are the love of my life. You make me want to be a better person. I want to be happy and content with you. And this goes right back to our first card. I'm a better person because of you. You inspire me. You make me want to be a better person. You inspire me to heal and grow from my past experiences. It comes first, full circle. It comes full circle. Let's try to reach other messages here. 
Where am I being drawn to? Okay. Please help the messages from a soul connection that finds it difficult to communicate face to face. So let us be the conduit. Let us be the conduit. Soul messages for soulmates in separation. I love our very deep conversations. They open up my mind. Yes, even you know, in five D counts. Here we go. Thank you. Thank you. Here we go. For dear soulmates who are not together, who are sometimes feeling isolated from each other. Whenever I see flowers, I think of you. Oh, Petunia. I remember the first day we met like it was yesterday. I play those memories over and over in my head. I can't wait to see you again. I can't wait to put my arms around you. Soulmate and separation, collective reading. I You appear often in my dreams. Were we just talking about 5D? Those were the great conversations that you remember. I wrote you a letter on paper, but I'm too afraid to share it or show it to you, to share it with you. Well, you remember in the, in the readings, was it yesterday or today, someone is practicing what they want to say to you. I can't help mentioning to you, to my close friends or family members. Okay, so little bits and pieces of this love. Um are being uh, <laughs> shared. However, they're still in four of pentacles where they want to keep the most of their love for you to themselves. Why? Because they don't want to be in the seven of wands defensive posture. Let's go here now. Let's go here now. Romance angels. For soulmate, the collective, soulmates in separation. Thank you. Heart-to-heart mm. -heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. Our deep conversations open up my mind. Heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Yes. Soulmate. How often does this card come up? Soulmate, yes, this is your soulmate. I'd like to just hand this to you through the computer screen. So have don't get it twisted. Yes, this is your soulmate. It is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. It is safe. It is safe for you to love. Playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. So that comes across, especially in the Six of Cups, that innocent, childlike puppy love. Let go of control issues. Some of these cards come up repeatedly. Allow this situation to what? Unfold naturally in divine timing. I know, I know. I'm tired of hearing that divine timing business, but it is. It is. The universe knows infinitely what is meant for us. And what is meant for us can never be denied. So as your soulmate has been promised to you, they will come forward. It will happen. Trust and believe. Soulmates and separation. Messages, please. My spirit is always with you. Can you feel me? Do you still love me too? Okay. Someone needs a little um, 
confidence that they're not going to be abandoned. I still feel connected to you, but I've waited too long to reach out. Is it too late for us? Do you guys see a theme here? Do you see a theme? I still see your smiling face in my mind's eye. Mm. You were my only sanctuary. You were the only person I could confide in and I betrayed your trust. How did that happen? By making you wait? By ghosting? Everywhere I go, I look around as if you'll magically be there. Okay, it's obvious this person, your soulmate in separation has a crush on you. They think of you oh, only three times a day, morning, noon, and night. I keep track of you from afar by looking you up on online. Not in a creepy stalker way, but in a, my heart misses you. I wonder if you still think about me. They don't know. Do you still think about me? How do you feel about me? Now that you've had time to reflect, now that you have gone into that Four of Swords energy. Remember what happened in our last reading for Taurus. Over here, there was a Four of Swords right here. And it was that you brilliantly knew it was time to recharge your batteries and recollect your energy. They feel this when you do it. And they think, oh, are they gone? Do they no longer love me? Have they found someone else? So you're going to find the, the uh, echoes of this message. I wonder if you still think about me. They're not feeling your energy. They need to, to know. Hmm. How can you convince them, though? How can you convince them? Sending them positive regard and unconditional love. Being apart has been more difficult than I can accept. Okay, so there's another theme right here. Being apart, missing you, worrying about time, waiting, knowing that um, you have helped their, their evolution, their soul growth. Please take a bow. Please um, realize that this is, you're an earth angel to them an earth angel. Please, more messages for soulmates in separation. This is a collective energy. Please add to this reading. Soulmates in separation. Thank you. What can we say? Play hard. Find time to laugh, goof off, and enjoy each other. That came out here too. Playfulness. Playfulness. Play hard. Be sure that, you know, especially in that beautiful Six of Cups. That Six of Cups energy of... You see, there there are no adults around in that card. Mm -hmm. it's, it's puppy love. It's enjoying, enjoying the... Um, innocence of true love here we go again soulmate your soulmate loves accepts and respects you this is your soulmate synchronicities all throughout your readings obstacles unhealed wounds are blocking forward movement we know this to be true because your person um, all but says so much Where is it? You're the love of my life. You make me want to be a better person. I want to be happy and content with you. But they are healing wounds that are otherwise becoming roadblocks to the connection. Twin flame, this is a divine counterpart connection. Okay. One more, I think. Awakening. Someone is undergoing a spiritual transformation. And when I say that that is painful, it is. Awakening, especially in this 3D world. What else can I bring for you? What else can I bring for you?
How about the, a couple light CO tarot cards? Soulmates in separation. Lovers. <laughs> Ten of Pentacles. Ace of Cups. Ten of Cups. One more. Nine of Swords. And that's right here. Okay, my darling dears. You see it all right here. The first card out is the Lover's card. They, it's difficult to see where one person stops and another one starts. I, they are so close, they're in, they're enmeshed, they're intertwined. Ten of Pentacles. The happy family, the, the family that has worked hard to find their place in the sun, and they're staking their claim. Ace of Cups. Beautiful. Love. A cup of love. A cup of love overflowing. Ten of cups. Ace of cups to the ten of cups. We've got the ten of pentacles and the ten of cups. So uh, the home life is going to be solid, sustainable. Um, a budget is on point and every, every bill is paid. And there is a lot of love. So we have sustainability for this home. What is the Nine of Swords, though, in the upright position? Some worry? Yeah. Uh, can I also say some missing? I miss you. That The missing pain, it's real. It's When you miss someone, especially as close as this soulmate connection is, it's a pain. It's a heartbreak. It's Three of Swords. It's, it's real. Um, don't get caught up in the pain, but acknowledge it um, and at that time send a silent prayer to your soulmate and um, give them big energy hugs they'll feel it yeah okay you guys you are you're incredible please take good care of yourselves I want to welcome the people who are tuning in from India Indonesia China and Mexico come on in um, if you're from a, a different country please say hello in the comments so we can say hello right back to you okay take good care now all right bye-bye